What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough, the 2022-2023 edition. I don't know, we will find out very, very soon, guys. Very, very soon. Anywho, in our last episode, we went through Rock Tunnel all the way to the power plant, and then right here to Cerulean City to solve a little issue, and that is, what was uh, causing this whole Kanto blackout, and on top of that, who was the shady character around here? We found out old Team Rocket member. Didn't realize that, you know, I broke up Team Rocket. Now, you would think that the gym would be open for business, but yet, yeah, there's still nobody right here. So, yeah, there's no water type gym leader right here. Look at that. Look at that. Looks good, right, guys? Gym leader Draven takes over again. Anywho, let's go right ahead and continue our little adventure right here by taking on some more Pokemon trainers and looking for Misty. Now, if you guys remember, in Pokemon Yellow, this guy right here is happy of his trades. He traded so many Pokemon, and I think, yes, this, no, that's not a, well, yeah, the king is gone, but you do trade, you do trade to him a Poliwhirl for a Jinx, and he's just, like, super happy. Now, there is a, let's see, if you talk to this individual, are you collecting Kanto gym badges? Yes, we are. We kind of are. If you go to the back side right here, you're going to be talking to this individual. He's going to be giving you a little bit of a... He's going to be giving you a little something like right here. He's like, There used to be a cave here that had this horribly powerful Pokemon in it. Next thing you know it... It's giving you a hint that... Huh? My item founder is responding. There is something afoot right there, which we will be getting to a little later. But yes, another part that got, you know, practically erased from uh, Kanto here in the second generation is... The Cerulean Cave, which had Pokemon up to level 60, including Mewtwo. And, you know, I get why they would do it, but then again, it's like, hey, you guys, it's like, seriously. You're taking all the fun out, come on, we need to train because eventually we have to take on Red, and you guys are being, you know, total a-holes about it. So, we're going to be taking on the six trainers, the six fabulous trainers for the fabulous prize. And what we're going to do right here again is we're going to be battling very, very quickly for, you know, because, well, you guys already know who these guys are. And they're going to be saying, yes, no regrets. We battled you with everything we got. So another thing, too, that kind of, uh, I guess, I guess you could say that Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver did right was the fact that they leveled up these guys uh, a little bit more. That way, you know, you'd be ready for, you know, your encounter against Red and all that stuff. And uh, they added just a little bit more later on, which, you know, is very, very, uh, very, very helpful for the trainer. And, well, let's see, look at that. Level 52, Serpentera. Oh, yeah, we brought in Serpentera yet again because, well, you know, we missed him. We missed him. Good. And, well, let's go ahead and fly away. And look at that. Coming out with a Vaporeon. Let's go with Chico. Hey, Chico. Razor Leaf, there you go. And just like that, another victory for us right there. Now, reason why I'm doing this in this episode is because, well, we gotta take on Misty. Alright, we have to. So, let's go right ahead and battle everybody we can. And there you go, coming out with a Pidgeotto. Let's go with Fluffolt. Fluffolt, Thunder Punch it, there we go, Roasted Chicken. And we're gonna continue on right here with a Fire Punch. Look at that, you see? Oh yeah, he's number five, he wants to stomp us. Let's go with Swift. I'm gonna beat this guy with Swift. You see that? Beat him with Swift. Okay, so moving on forward right here. Taking on this lady. She is the last in line and she wants to be tough. So we're gonna fly. Fly away, little birdie. And we're gonna take on a Parasect. So let's go with Hera. And flame throw away. There you go. Trying to learn Crunch. Okay, so this is a big debate, but I'm gonna do it anyways. I'm gonna teach it Crunch. I'm gonna take away all that unlimited accuracy for more power right here. I kind of wish it would, it would happen for, like, other such moves and all that stuff, but we're going to continue on right here. Going with Paris right here. Okay. Luckily, we do have a Paris of our own that, you know, actually helped us out for reels and all that stuff. And crap baskets. We need it again. We need that... <laughs> we need that Pokeball right there. Okay, so this guy's not part of the, the challenge and all that stuff, but he... Oh, wow. He froze us. Good gravy. Okay. Well... <sighs> You kind of messed me, you kind of pissed me off, so let's go right ahead and use a swift attack, and there we go, we defeated this guy right here. So we're earning a lot of money, and we're going to be switching out our Pokemon right here. Let's go straight 
to good old Hera yet again. And, well, talk to this guy. You took on one more battle than you expected, but you won anyway. As promised, you win a prize, and there we go, we get ourselves the Nugget. And no, he's not gonna, he's not gonna offer us to, you know, to go to Team Rocket and everything. So we're gonna be battling him one last time. Bring it on, he's a cool trainer, he's about to get this flamethrower, and he's coming out with a, a War Turtle. Chico, let's go, Razor Leaf. There you go, and he's coming out with a Charmeleon. So, let's go, do, 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 do. Togepi, fly attack, fly attack again, and there you go, we have defeated uh, this individual, yes. You and your Pokemon are truly outstanding. Okay, so, after doing that, you'll see this. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ran away from Misty, and she's like, oh, why did you have to go and show up and bug us now? Do you know what they call people like you? Pest. You heard me right, pest. Oh, those badges you have. Are they Johto Gym badges? If you have eight, you must be good. Okay then, come to the Cerulean Gym. I'll be happy to take you on. I'm Misty, the gym leader in the Cerule in Cerulean. Well, well, she called us pest and all that stuff. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna show up to you. And well, this is the Sea Cottage, the legendary Sea Cottage, where you will be able to find Bill. But this time around, you're gonna be finding his grandfather. Hmm, you know Bill. He's my grandson. He's in Johto. He does something uh, with PCs, so I'm house sitting. My grandson Bill told me about a, a Pokemon that has a long tongue. If you have that Pokemon, may I see it, please? I don't have that Pokemon, but eventually, you know, you get good prizes with this guy right here. That's, so that's the reason why you need to capture a lot of Pokemon right here. Anywho, let's go right ahead. Let's go right ahead and get on with what we were here for. And that is to defeat Misty. And pretty much just like, you know, fulfill the destiny that we did in Heart Gold, the last episode and all that stuff. Which, by the way, which, by the way, I think I mentioned this in the last few episodes. Yes, we will be redoing Pokemon uh, Heart Gold at some point for you guys' entertainment. What is going to happen with the old Heart Gold walkthrough? That has yet to be determined. I'm probably just gonna just, uh, I'm just probably gonna, like, uh, switch the settings on it. That way you guys can have the brand new one. Who knows? We shall find out. But as far as I'm concerned, we are going to redo this walkthrough because, well, many of you guys love it and all that crud. So, here we go. Don't let my elegant swimming unnerve you. Hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Bring it. Let's go, and we're taking on Brianna, and I just realized something, so here goes a Thunder Punch, and let's go with Chico, let's finish this off, here we go, and just like that, we have defeated another trainer. Okay, so I realized something right here, I'll be right back with you guys. Well, okay, so what I have forgotten, guys, is that we need to switch up our Pokemon for this particular battle, yes. We do have a Pokemon that... You know, has a certain relationship with a uh, certain niece that I have, and she was not too happy about losing, so she wants me to get that win back. So we're gonna be going back to a few Pokemon that we uh, adore and love, and here comes Aaliyah. Bring it! Thunder Attack! And it missed. Thunder Attack, yes, there we go. Okay. So, yes, Aaliyah is back onto the team, and uh, well. Yeah, Sir Razor right here, too. And a good thing about this is that, bam, Razor Leaf and all that stuff. Okay, so we do have the Pokemon ready for this situation right here. And yes, we are definitely going to be using some stuff. Well, we're definitely going to be using Sir Razor just a little bit more right here because, well, he hasn't had his chance to shine. So, here we go. Diana wants the battle, and she is coming out with her Golduck. Look at this Golduck right here. All right, bring it. And, well, let's go with a Thunder Attack right here. It misses. Good gravy. Gotta love Rain Dance and all that stuff. Okay, there you go. And Sir Patera keeps on growing to levels. Yes. Okay. So, let's get back into it. I was expecting you, you pest. You may have a lot of Johto Gym badges, but you'd better not take me too lightly. My Water-type Pokemon are tough. Alrighty, bring it. I love this song. Okay, guys, so here it is, guys. Gym battle number 13, and it is gym leader Misty. Mm, 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 mm. Looking fine, as always, and she is coming out with her Golduck right here. Level 42. 
And, well, let's give Aaliyah its win back right here. That's right, we're dominating with just a Pikachu. You didn't think I had a Pikachu! No, you didn't. The Return of Draven from Generation 1. Look at that. Okay, and, well... There we go. Alrighty, so who's next? Quagsire, she's come prepared. And guess what? So did I. Let's go with Sir Razor. Alrighty. Bring it. And I seem to have remembered that you had a quad kind of a weakness to a Pokemon, so let's go prepare for battle right here. Solar Beam ready to go. And, well, look at that. It's preparing its, its amnesia. And there we go. Time to take this Solar Beam. For the win, let's go. Say goodbye, say goodbye. Yes, throwing out that peace sign. Critical hit. Ah, Sir Razor, you're... Yeah, that's right. Sir Razor's doing its thing. And, well, she's about to come out with a Lapras right here. So we're going to stick with Sir Razor, even though it's a little bit risky. Because, well, obviously Lapras is does have a move here and there that will try and uh, mess with us. So it's falling asleep. That's right. Strategy. Time to take this solar beam yet again. That's right. If I... Well, I do have Sunny Day. I could have done this a little bit faster. Alright, bring it on. Time to take this solar beam. For the win. There you go. Oh my god. And that's how you do it. You put it to sleep, you solar beam it. That's how you do it. America. And, well, let's see. She's going to be coming out with a star me. Let's go right ahead and finish it off. Let's go with Leah right here. Bring it. So who's faster? Star me at level 47? A good old Aaliyah at level 57. Let's go. Thunder attack. Oh, crap, baskets. And here comes that surf attack. Definitely something that we don't want to take right now. No buckets. And... Oh, God. So my niece is going to be pissed at me. Let's go, Chico. Avenger. Alrighty, body slam. That's right. I, I should have done Razor Leaf, but still. There we go. And you are now paralyzed, you a-hole Pokemon, you. And time to finish you off. Razor Leaf. That's right. Gym Leader Draven is strategic. And a little bit lucky at the same time, too. So there you go. That's how you do it. Chico has done it. Serpentera, get some more points. Throwing out that peace sign. You really are good. I'll admit that you are skilled. Here you go. It's the Cascade Batch. Thank you. Thank you. Now, take back the pest thing. Whew. Alrighty. Okay, so, um, you know, my vest is feeling a little bit, you know, heavy because uh, 13 badges and all. Are there many strong trainers in Johto like you? I mean, I'm going to travel one day so I can battle some skilled trainers. Well, you could do that, but there really are, there really isn't a lot of strong trainers out there, which is kind of a bummer and all that stuff. Anywho, that's right guys, we won. We have won and we're gonna heal up our Pokemon now. There is one little thing that we need to do, okay? There's one more thing we need to do, and that is to find out what exactly was that little thing that was being triggered in all that crud baskets. So we're going to go all the way back up what was the Nugget Trail, and wow, oh crap baskets, okay. So I should probably use a Repel because I don't need any of these, I don't need the drama right now. And look at that, okay. So it's made it a little bit easier right here, so let's go. Uh, wait, oh wow, crap baskets. Oh, I don't have a Pokemon in Surf's. Uh, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so here we are back, and, uh, well, we're gonna be surfing. Got our original team back, and, uh, well, let's see what this whole thing is all about. And, of course, our Repel has to go away and all that crud. Alright. Let's go right here. So, apparently, there's something lingering in this general location. If you go right here, we will find a Berserk Gene. If you guys don't know what this is, it's kind of a messed up thing. So, this is kind of the equivalent of Swagger Attack as a held item. Boosts the attack, but causes confusion. Now, this comes from Mewtwo. Believe it or not, it's from Mewtwo, okay? 
The only messed up part is that it it's a one time it's a one time thing. So there is no reason for yeah, there was no reason for that at all. I mean, yeah, you can't really go anywhere right here, Route Four. So yeah, we're gonna be serving back. That is exactly what was left from uh, good old uh, good old Mewtwo and all that stuff. So I guess we're gonna have to go back to Cerulean City. Okay. Alrighty. So. That is pretty much it right there, guys. It has been a nice adventure right here. In the next episode, we're going to be doing a little bit of side questing. Very, very quick side questing for all of you guys to see. And then after that, we're finally going to go to Pewter and everything else. And almost finish up this whole walkthrough right here. So thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys for staying patient and all that stuff. If you guys want to make a small donation to the channel, the link is right there. If it works, it, uh, it works. Uh, you know, there's a heart button right there. Go right ahead and do that. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. See you guys.